everyone, it's Cafe, and welcome back to my channel. For this week's video, we're looking at my top 5 Chrome extensions for students. So starting off with Weva, it's a highlighting tool that you can use for websites and PDFs. It's a great tool for your research papers. So right now we are at the Weva homepage in which you divide all of your different highlightings into select files that make it easier to access for your research papers. And as you can see, it even takes you back to the original site in which you got the information from, as well as the opportunity to color coordinate each of the different segments that you want, as well as add notes to your highlightings. It's also great for group projects because you can add other collaborators. You even have the ability to upload PDFs and other files to keep all of your information together. Weva also has the ability to create subfolders within each folder to further organize your work. Weva also has a feature that helps you cite citations. While this can be very helpful, I would recommend double checking the citations on your own. Now moving on to Todoist for Chrome, it's a nice to-do list feature that you can easily have on your screen. Todoist is a great extension for having a to-do list right beside you when you work to keep you organized. You can easily divide your to-dos based on class or subject. There is also the ability to add subtasks and sites for easier access. With the ability to add labels, prioritize, add due dates, and etc. With Todoist, you can easily keep track of your tasks on a daily basis. It doesn't have to be just for today, it can be for any time. The extension also keeps track of what you have done and gives you an overview of your current productivity. Next we have Marinara, the Pomodora Assistant. Marinara works as a Pomodoro assistant as an extension that tells you when to work and when you can take breaks. As you can see, I haven't been using it recently since I'm on summer break. You can easily customize it so you can choose the time ranges that work best for you. And it's easily accessible in the top right hand corner of your Google Chrome where your extensions are. So you can easily start, stop, and restart your timer. And since Marinara keeps track of your history using the extension, you also have the ability to save your overview outside of Marinara. You should also keep in mind that Marinara does not block sites from you, it's just more of a timer. Now for the Dark Reader extension, it easily allows you to modify your websites to a dark mode. This extension is great for online readings and it gives you the ability to customize how you would like your dark mode to be set up so you can change the brightness, the contrast, the sepia, as well as the grayscale. You can easily change any of the sites you are using to a dark mode using this extension, making it much easier on your eyes when it comes to reading online sites and you also have the option to pick specific websites that you would like to keep the dark mode function on. Lastly, we have Speechify, which allows you to listen to the content that you're supposed to be reading. It's especially helpful to those who prefer listening rather than reading. It's also helpful for not just class readings, but also anything else like emails. It allows you to change the speech speed and reader voice to your preference. While there's also a pro slash paid version of this extension, there's also a free version that can also be very helpful. And as you can see, there's also a wide range of reader voices that you can select from, so you can really customize it to your preference. And this extension also has a dark mode that you can activate. also have the option to listen to your own PDFs and not just websites on Chrome. 
the PDF version is also very similar to the site version in which it has the same abilities with changing the speech speed and reader voice. Emulations play a central role during adolescence, becoming a main developmental niche. A doom. Laysense are driven by the need for belonging to their peer groups, but also for establishing intimate relationships with their peers. Ojanin. Grand Rusen. Salmi Valley. 2005. Peer groups establish social norms and give meaning to social experiences at the same time. And that concludes my video for my top 5 Google Chrome extensions for students. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you next time!